please explain how your understanding of the word reciprocity helped shape your approach to photography? So, you know that that's like the, the holy grail to photography. If I give out this little piece of knowledge, then people won't go on the journey. So, I mean, it's, it's, it's when I got to understanding what reciprocity was, literally, my brain went, because in the whole darkness, walking around in the darkness, you do book your toe, you book your elbow, and every one of these, you learn, you're like, why, why, why? If you just, if I just say, you know what, let me just throw reciprocity into the darkness, people don't get the hit. But reciprocity is the fundamental way of understanding what do I want in a picture? Do I want you, the background blow, blown out, and why do I want the background blown out? Or do I want you and be able to tell what, how your environment is shaping this image? Reciprocity. And you have to be able to do that quickly on the lens. Please explain the process you use as a photojournalist to tell a detailed story through pictures. The process? Um, I usually start with what do I want to say? And the most important part of that question is why do I want to say it? The third thing is who am I speaking to? Um, for me, again, it's 24 to 24. I work between 24 and 50 normally. I can usually, if I have to do a portrait with a 21, 21 millimeter lens, I do a portrait with a 21 millimeter lens. But the idea is I, I usually want to, to have a conversation with the things that are around. Um, I carry street photography. I marry street photography with my two years at Vogue. I'm going to give you style, but I'm going to put it in a setting where you can have a conversation with whatever is in the picture. For instance, I photographed this kid with a box of Kentucky Fried Chicken, but it had the f American flag on it. And for me, what I'm saying to you is we have been eating capitalism. We've been eating. You can't see the chicken. There's no chicken. It's the box with the American flag on it. So that's what he's eating. He's, this black person is eating up America. Um, so I do stuff like that. 